So the ladies and gentlemen, we are live on Fight TV. So for those joining us at home and those watching around the world, Eastbourne, are you ready? I can you, Eastbourne, are you ready? Then ladies and gentlemen, our first bout of the evening. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, please welcome George Garcia. opponent fighting out of the red corner please welcome Alex of Haniti first bout of the evening brought to you in association with KNA Hair Beauty is a boxing contest to be fought over three two minute rounds. Introducing first, boxing out of the blue corner, representing Box Spa, please welcome George Garcia. His opponent standing across the cage, fighting out the red corner representing Sparta. Please welcome Alex Alphanides. Got to see her in the blue. Alphanides in the red. Our referee in charge of the action, Mr. Dan Moverheady. Our first fight of the evening here at Sparta Fight Series 2, coming to you live from Eastbourne. Dean Midat here with Colin Howes on the commentary. 
and we get underway in this first boxing bout. George Garcia versus Alex Opendides. Opendides. And already George is using that jab here, Colin, to establish some dominance. Yeah, they're not hanging around at all here, getting stuck in. Um, Garcia is, is, yeah, is really using his jab, putting some, together some good combinations to start with. And Opanides looking for that right hand here. And he backed Garcia up there. Garcia's got some lovely head movement, but he can't take too many of those shots. Yeah, no, great head movement. You know, he's, he's not been touched yet. But he doesn't want, he wants to be careful. Opanides looks like he's got a lot of power. He doesn't want any of those to connect. And that was the argument coming in here. Opanides has got very big power. He's, he's just ex accentuating his, his endurance. And look at this jab. He's got beautiful endurance here. Is he going to be able to kind of close down and nullify the experience of Garcia? Yeah, I'm not sure. I mean, I, I'm not sure what happened there. Garcia was looking at the referee. I'm not sure what he, what he was trying to say, um, but he stopped for a moment there. But he did get caught with a few there. He's got to be really careful with this with this uh, arms down head movement situation. Well, Penny does with some nice head work of his own. He's eating those body shots, however. Garcia likes to soften up that body when he's close quarters. Some big heavy punches. It's even power in that jab there. You can see it's kind of stunning Garcia, but he keeps driving forward. Yeah, Garcia's just coming forward. To, oh, he got tagged. He got tagged. Right on the chin. And Morgan that's the Edith. dangerous game you play, Colin, when you put your hands down like that and move the heads around, head around. I mean, he's had some elusive head movement, but his arms are not sticking to his head. Yeah, you can only get away with that for so long. You might want to keep his hands up now. So Orpanides has got to go for the kill here. There's a 10 second clapper. He's got to really hunt for this fight. He's got to land that power right hand. Nice, very, very nice round, action packed. Yeah, the first fight here, a Sparta fight series. And it's already on the edge of my seat here, Colin. Some beautiful power being shown from Alex. I mean, and there's the experience shown through from Garcia, but it's almost too much experience. You almost seem too comfortable to use the head movement without the hands on his head. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it, it, he, you know, he did have the head movement, but he seemed to slow down a little bit and he got caught right on the chin um, and he got his, his standing eight count. Um, yeah, I mean, now he really wants to think about keeping those hands up and maybe a little bit less of that, be a little bit more maybe conservative because he's been tagged already. So, you know, he may want to keep his hands up this time. Round two, Garcia or Banides. Boxing bout here at Sparta Fight Series. And already we've seen Garcia rock. So he's going to turn the pace up. Is he going to try and land those power left hooks? Yeah, I, I feel like maybe Garcia's rushing a little bit here. You know, he's walking in. This is only a matter of time, you know, that he may get caught. Some nice hip head movement there from Garcia. He dips quite quite low when he tries to almost, it's almost like a slip and a roll combined but he's not putting anything on the end of it just like that there we go now he's put strikes on the end of that use that movement to load up punches go to the body and go to the head yeah definitely I mean Garcia's hooks a few of them have been landing you know so some, some good hooks and there's that complaint again you adhere to I think he's kind of he's alluding to the fact that El Panides is pushing him out but almost catching him with the elbow as he pushes him out yeah I mean it's, it's all legal so far as far as I can see and this is, I mean, look at this, Alex's first fight, and you wouldn't believe it looking at him in there. No, I mean, he's very composed, you know. Really look, really knows what he's doing in there. Um, he is, you know, Garcia is getting through with some of these shots, though. So he's got to be careful. Garcia did a good job of smothering him. He's got a very good pressure forward, and he's moving ahead a lot more now. He's taking less shots. He's doing a good job of smothering the work of Alex here. Yeah, Alex wants to fire that big power hand straight down the center, but if he's getting smothered by Garcia, he just can't load up. You can see he's forced to cover up and initiate the clinch. Yeah, and, and one or two of them are getting through. Big overhand right there from Alex. That was beautiful, but I mean, Garcia is keeping his hands up now, nice and tight in these exchanges. Oh. Now, very nice. Garcia is putting, putting them together now. He's getting the combinations. It's like the, you know, fires, fires inside his belly. And you can clearly see the difference in power here. Garcia's got to keep this movement working, keep the pressure on, use his cardio to make Alex tired. 
Uh, another explosive round here in this first boxing bout, Sparta Fight Series. Um, but we saw Garcia kind of change his game plan up there. He kept his hands nice and high, used a lot of uh, footwork and movement. But more importantly, he kind of closed Alex down. He stopped him working at that range. Yeah, and it's worked very well for him. He's got very close to him. The combinations, you know, a few, a few of the shots are getting through. Uh, Garcia's hooks are, are, are pretty good. They are getting through and, and connecting. I think this is uh, the real test of conditioning, though, for both fighters in this, this last round because they're giving it everything. And, um, you know, this last round, is really gonna, we're really going to see what sort of conditioning these guys have. Round three, and already Garcia now putting the pressure on working that left hook. Working the head movement again, but he's dropping the hands, a very dangerous game. Yeah, I think he should stick to what he did in the last round and just really um, smother or from just stay on top of him. Don't let him work. I mean, Orfanides is, a, is a, a power puncher. You can see he winds up with big shots. You, d you don't want him to get comfortable and be able to start throwing those types of shots. So, yeah, Garcia's smothering his tactics. So, good, good shout at the moment. Another clinch here, separation by the referee. And Alex here looking to target with that left hook, but the second Garcia slips that, he's all over him. Excellent tactics here from Garcia. And a nice left hook from Garcia, really connected. And what a turnaround in this fight. I mean, we saw Garcia get dropped in the first round. And now in the second and third, he's just put into work. Look at this, he's going to the body, he's going to the head. He did a great job being elusive and smothering Alex. I think Garcia knows he's got, you know, he has to really work hard to, to pull this back. Nice that. combinations here by Garcia. Yeah, both guys coming for it now. Alex is calling, they're looking, they're looking to use the jab to set up the overhand right and work the uppercuts when he comes in. He's just having such a difficult job there. It looks like he's tired now here. You can see he's breathing quite heavily through the mouth. The mouth is open now, Colin. Yes, it's breathing heavy. Garcia, I think, knows this. I mean, Garcia's conditioning, he's not, he's not taking a back step yet. You know, he's definitely got the conditioning. At 46 years young, I mean, it's just showing. I think he, he might just caught a little bit of a forearm there, but he's, he's kind of very vocal to the ref, but he's just got to use this time to recover. Oh. And is that going to be the turnaround for this round here? I mean, is that, that are they going to count that, the judge is going to count that as, as, a, as a, a standing count, a drop? Like what they're going to, you know, you never know because there's three judges here at ringside, experienced judges, but they could all, they could all believe different things. Yeah, um, I, I mean, I think really Garcia re really put it on Orfanidis in the last two rounds there but that that was a standing eight count in that last round so um you know technically he should lose that round i would say nonetheless we go to the judges scorecards here as part of fight series welcome to those watching at home on fight tv coming to you live from eastbourne ladies and gentlemen please show your appreciation for both warriors this evening Well, ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to our judges' scorecards. With the unanimous decision, your winner in the red corner, Alice Orfanini. <laughs> Big thank you to George Garcia as well for taking the fight. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, join me at this time. Oh, his bag. Look at that. Give it. Alex, just talk us through the fight. See how you, uh, what was your thoughts on it? First round seemed to take a bit of control. Yeah. Second round, you had a bit of difficulty perhaps there. Yeah, it was dealing with the, the stamina. Uh, I've never felt this kind of adrenaline before, but I know what I'm up for next time and uh, yeah, I was ready as much as I can be. I, I gave him my all, so it was good. Tough opponent then in uh, Garcia for you this evening? Yeah, I mean, I could see he's used his experience against me, but I mean, his punches wouldn't 
affect me to the point I'll drop. There was too much there. It, he would have to take a lot to drop me. That's one thing that I felt, I felt his hard punch. It didn't do nothing, it's just my stamina wasn't good enough. Next time, training will be a lot more better. So next training camp then, look to the coaches, they're already nodding their head into the cardio. Get on with it, get it done, and then we'll see you back here again. What's next? More training, more technique, and uh, more progress. More progress, yeah, and that's it. Well, we look forward to seeing more from you in the future. Ladies and gentlemen, get up for your winner, Alex Obanini.